What's up guys? In this video, we're going to break down a practice question about how suctioning a patient can affect their peak pressure. Are you ready? Let's go! Before we get into the question, I just want to take a quick second to tell you about our Practice Questions Pro membership. How would you like to get new TMC practice questions like the ones in our videos sent to your inbox every single day? Well, the good news is now you can. Going through a new practice question every day may sound like a small thing, but over time, the knowledge that you'll gain will add up to huge results. So if you're interested in getting our premium practice questions delivered to your inbox on a daily basis, check out the link below at the top of the description. Now let's get into the practice question. You are called to assess a patient on the ventilator that is currently in volume control mode. After performing endotracheal suctioning, which of the following would indicate effective clearance of retained secretions? Is it A, a smaller tidal volume, B, a decreased inspiratory time, C, a lower plateau pressure, or D, a lower peak pressure? The correct answer is D, a lower peak pressure. In general, you should remember that retained secretions will cause the patient's airway resistance and peak airway pressure to increase during volume control ventilation. So taking that into consideration, the effective clearance of secretions via suctioning should effectively decrease the patient's peak airway pressure. On the other hand, if the patient had been receiving pressure control ventilation, you would expect an increase in delivered volume once the secretions are cleared. None of the other answer choices really make sense in this situation, so you know that the correct answer has to be D, a lower peak pressure. Alright guys, that is it. Thank you so much for watching all the way to the end. Do me a favor, hit that thumbs up button, leave a comment below, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks again for watching, and I will see you in the next video. And as always, breathe easy, my friend.